Hi and welcome students. In today's Microsoft PowerPoint 2019 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a new presentation. Let's get started. So you'll see that I opened up PowerPoint here and in my last video I went over how to open up a blank presentation and the user interface. But on this one I'm going to show you how to open up a presentation using a template and enter text into that presentation as well as change the theme at the end. Let's get started. So you'll see here that I have a list of different themes to choose from. On this list, you can search for a list of themes up at the top, but on this one, we're gonna choose this one right here, Facet, so let's click it. When we click that, it looks like this, and it gives us a preview. This is called the preview of our slide theme, and over here are different variants or color schemes that we could choose from. These are called variants within PowerPoint, but these are called color variations as well, so you'll hear both uh, names are chosen. You could click between any of these to see what they'll look like. For ours, we're just going to stick with the default one, which is this right here. And you can follow along with me if you'd like. So that's what it'll look like. And then to create it, we simply go right here and click Create. When that happens, the PowerPoint presentation will open and it'll give, a, give it a default name of Presentation 1. On the left side over here, you'll see the slide thumbnail that has the theme. The main area is called the slide pane. The status bar is down at the bottom, as well as um, some different options down here. But what we're main fo mainly focused on right now is entering presentation text. And so for entering presentation text, the first slide is usually the title slide in the presentation. This will be the first slide that your uh, viewers see when they view this presentation. And so in the slide pane area, it says click to add title. When you click inside of here with your mouse, you'll see that the text disappears. That's because obviously you're not going to put click to add a title in your presentation. This is where the title of your presentation will go. And this area that we're typing in right now is called a placeholder. When you click within it, the text will allow you to type in which we can type in Kodiak West. There we go. After we type that in, we now see that down below, there's another placeholder. That placeholder says, click to add subtitle. Click inside here, and we're going to type in your travel. And if we wanted to create a new line, it's the same way we would, we would create a new line or paragraph in Microsoft Word. You simply press enter. When you press enter, it'll create that new line. And now we're going to type in your way. Looks good. Okay, so we've created our title slide now and let's say that we are looking at this and we decide we don't really like the theme anymore. Okay, now it's early on to change our theme, but we can, we can change our theme early, that's no, that's no big deal. To change your theme, this can be found in the design tab. Let's go up to the design tab and you'll see that there's a themes group right here. This themes group has a list of different themes to choose from. You'll also see those variants that I mentioned earlier, the color schemes, over here in the variants group, and you can always change to any of those ones. When you hover over these, it'll also show you a preview of what those themes look like. Now let's say that you're not happy with any of the ones that you see here, and you want to view more. Well, this area that shows all of these different um, themes is called a gallery. And at the bottom right of any gallery, there's options. So look at the right side here. You could go down to the next row, or you can press this button, which is the one I press all the time, more. And when you press more, it'll open up all of the themes available. Now you'll see that you have a longer list of themes to choose from. And I'm going to look at this one here, which is called organic. If I wanted to change to the organic theme, I would simply click on organic and it would change the theme right there. Now you'll notice that the colors, the fonts, the effects, all of these things change along with it. And so once that's done, we can always change the theme if we want to again, or we can even look through different variants of this theme. So just because you see one theme doesn't mean that there might be a, might not be a variant 
in that theme that you like more than the one that you already have chosen. So I encourage you to take a look around PowerPoint and take a look at some of the themes and choosing some different variants because I'm sure if you've seen a bunch of PowerPoint presentations, you've seen the same sort of themes over and over and over again. Well, changing these themes uh, in your presentation can allow a little bit more uniqueness when people are viewing your presentations. So I hope this video has helped you out. If it has, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. I do have a Microsoft PowerPoint playlist on my channel if you'd like to learn more. And if you have any questions or comments, please put them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to help you out. Thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.